Hey guys, what up? It's your girl Chelsea and today I am hitting the streets going to interview foreigners about their thoughts on the Korean language. Let's go. I'm Tara. Nice to meet you, Tara. And nice what country you. are you from? I'm from the United States. Uh, my name is Noel. Nice to meet you. And what country are you from? Uh, nice to meet you too. In, I'm from South Africa. South Africa, lovely. Uh, Andre. Nice to meet you, Andre. And what country are you from? I'm from the United States. My name is Suleiman Banalekachi. And where are you from? I'm from Uganda. Do you know any Korean? Uh, Hangul or Jokong. I know a little Korean. A little bit. And what were your motivations, if any, for learning the language? Or did you not want to learn the language originally? I really wanted to learn the language. I've been here seven years. Mm. And um, I'm an international school teacher. Mm. So I'm motivated. It's just a little more difficult than I had anticipated. Mm. Korean language. The way I listen to it, it's not easy. Mm. <laughs> Even if when they pronounce any word, you say, oh! Is he talking, following, ordering, what you know, eh? Mm. The way they speak, I feel hi. But uh, I think it's not easy. Actually, it's not easy. Because when uh, some people, when, when they talk, eh? You feel like, huh? Is he talking to somebody? Oh, you understand? It's not like English. It's not like any other language I've ever heard. Yeah, it's, I think it's difficult. Mm. Very, very difficult. Do you have any desire to maybe learn Korean or try and learn Korean one day? Yes, I would like. I would like to learn Korean language, but I think it will take me time, time because the way I hear people talk, it will take me too much time to learn it and understand it. Mm. Yeah, I, I think it's, I think it's not too easy, right. but I think I, I would like to learn it. I know a little bit. I'm starting to learn. You're starting to learn. Yeah, I'm taking it? a okay. class. When was the first time you were ever exposed to the Korean language? At a, um. I worked at a Korea market when I was younger, so I, I heard like a little bit of it. Okay, and did you have like a desire to want to learn it? And if so, what was that reason for wanting to learn Korean language? I didn't have a desire until I came here the first time. And then when I went back to the States, I would meet people and they'll be like, oh, you're like, you were in Korea, and then they'll say something to me in Korean, and I'd be like, Oh, no, I didn't really learn the language, so <laughs> this time around I want to like learn and go back and speak more fluently and stuff. So. Korean language, really I don't know the language, though I'm interested to learn a little bit of it. Uh, what I find here, it is very hard to learn the language because everybody speaks Korea. So for me as a foreigner, nobody to interact with. And the most of Koreans are very, very proud with their language. So I find it very difficult to learn the language because nobody to speak to. How does the Korean language compare to other Asianic languages? Um, it's, I feel like the Korean language is a deeper, more stronger um, soundy language. Mm -hmm. uh, it's still, um, you have all these symbols that you have to learn. It's, it's, it's very complicated. Mm -hmm. I think there was no big difference between Chinese and Japanese. Mm. The way they talk and uh, their writings, they're almost the same. Mm. So I think there was no big difference. Mm. Um, I know it's, it's like a little bit easier than uh, Mandarin. I took Mandarin for like two years. Mm. And I'll say like Korean language is a little bit easier, but it is still complicated though. Like every time I learn something, somebody tells me something else. So it's... Uganda is Swahili language and uh, our Eng uh, English and uh, our local languages, so there's no way near to any Asian language, including Korean language. It's not as well known. You hear it more and more in the United States now. I'm from an area where there's a big Korean population, so I hear it um, in the restaurants, in the, in the shopping malls, in the community, so I'm familiar with it. Um, yeah, again, it's just trying to speak it is difficult. It's good. And yeah. is there anything you would like to say to the viewers? Um, this is only I third day I in just Korea, them, by the way. I just wish them here happy summer because now we are approaching summer. Mm. Yeah, just enjoy your summer time. Love you all. I would love to say I love Korea. I've been here seven years and it's it's my home away from home. Wonderful. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thanks. Is there anything you can say maybe in Korean to the viewers? Oh, not in Andre Midan. <laughs> 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 Thank you very much.